हेलो एवरीवन दिस इज संजय कुवर वेलकम बैक फॉर लर्निंग ग्रामर सब्जेक्ट टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू लर्न एन इंटरेस्टिंग लेसन स्टोरी राइटिंग डे स्टूडेंट्स वी लाइक टू लिसन रीड राइट एंड वॉच स्टोरीज डू यू नो व्हाट इज स्टोरी अ स्टोरी इज ए डिस्क्रिप्शन ऑफ इवेंट्स एंड द कैरेक्टर्स that the writer or speaker has invented in order to entertain people there are basic elements of story they are setting characters plot conflict and theme setting is the time and place of the story characters are used to perform actions and speak dialogues plot is the sequence of events in the story conflict is a struggle of the different characters in the story and the last one is theme theme is the central idea of the story now dear students let's understand some points while writing stories it should have attractive beginning middle and end give suitable title to the story wherever possible use direct speech so that the characters would appear real it can be real or imaginary write in paragraph form don't shift carelessly from past tense to the present tense or from present tense to the past tense dear students you may be asked to observe pictures and write the story or you may be given an outline and asked to develop a meaningful story now let's try to learn how to write a story with the help of an example look at this outline of the story two friends one was fat and the other was lean passing through a forest they saw a bear the lean climb up a tree the fat could not lay down on the ground the bear came and went away the moral of the story now dear students let's develop a meaningful story with the help of the given outline first the title of the story the selfish friend once there lived two friends named mohan and sohan in a village sohan was very fat and Mohan was very lean. They made up their mind to go together and earn a living. They set out on a long journey. Their way lay through a dense forest. It was full of wild animals. So they promised each other to help in their trouble. After some time walking through the dense forest. they heard a rustling sound in the bushes mohan said what do you think it is sohan replied i don't know i can't see it just then a large dark figure appeared ahead of them mohan shouted oh no it's a wild bear run run fast saying so he climbed up a tall tree and sat on one of its branches but his friend didn't know how to climb up the tree so he requested to him please help me mohan please help me to climb up the tree but mohan didn't help him so one had heard that bears don't attack dead things therefore he lay down on the ground 
and head is breath to look dead the bear came close to him and smelled him all over his body it took him for dead and went away after the bear had left mohan came down from the tree and asked are you all right well my friend what did the bear say to you sohan replied the bear advised me to keep away from selfish friends like you so dear students do you like the story what is the moral of the story yes a friend in need is a friend indeed